Suomi vikaksi. Suomi vikaksi. Lowry. Right here in front. Oh. <laughs> I know we uh, talked about it a little bit yesterday, but uh, what was it like getting picked last last? Did, that, did it bother you at all? Yeah, be your own people. You called it. Just such a hater. Uh, I mean, I didn't really care. Want to come over here? Uh, I mean, I'm just glad to be a part of this whole experience. So, I mean, just, I didn't really care. But, I mean, he thought he was the last pick. So, that's why he stood up so early and made me look even worse. So, I, I blame it on him. All right. <laughs> Front left. Mikä oli viikonlopun kohokohta? No varmaan tämä ilta viettää se perheen kanssa ja, tota, tai viettää se kentälle ja että on perhe mukana katsomassa ja hengätä niiden kanssa ja totta kai kiireinen viikonloppu, niin oli ihan siisti kokea tämä kaikki kotikaupungissa. Oliko tässä pelissä jotain sellaista tiettyä hetkeä, mikä erityisesti jäi mieleen? No ensimmäinen korja oli ihan siisti, mutta totta kai voittaminen. Kokonaisuudessa, niin kun mietit tätä kaikkea pyöritystä, mitä sulla on tässä ollut, niin minkälainen kokemus tämä on ollut sun uralle? Tosi siisti kokemus. Aikalailla sitä, mitä odotin, ja, tota, mutta tosi kiitollinen olo ja mukava olla täällä. Ja, tota, en malta odottaa, että pääsee uudestaan. I was excited to get out there and uh, obviously the whole weekend. I mean, yesterday I got, got to participate in the three-point contest, but this is what I, we were waiting for. And uh, I mean, it was, I was just happy to get out there and uh, play with those guys. What was it like, you know, just uh, representing the Jazz, you know, being here in your hometown now that it's over? How does it feel? feels good. Uh, like I said, it's just a great experience to be a part of, uh, and I can't wait to be here again. So, I, I mean, now you rest a couple of days and I'm excited to get back to work. Lowry, over here, you, you kind of hesitated on that uh, last shot, I, kind of like you didn't want to take it. Did you not want to take it or did you want, you know, what, were you, what was going through your head at that point? No, I was just thinking uh, if I should go dunk it or shoot a three, that's what I was thinking. Uh, Joel was kind of trying to get me to the paint and go dunk it, so then that's why it took so long to shoot that three. But. I mean, it would have been cool to knock that one down, but we got the job done. So. Back right. Hey, hey, Laurie. Um, with the draft being so shortly before the game, what was the situation like? Did you have switch lockers? Uh, because being in the West locker and Team Giannis, um, what's the situation like for you? Yeah, it was pretty long wait in the back, but I mean, it was worth it to get out there and uh, get selected, and then just. It was pretty easy transition. They did a good job of moving our stuff from the other locker room to the other one. So you just walk into. It was a while that I was. I've been in the visiting locker room here, so I mean, it was. It was cool to see. Last question on the left side. Larry, I'm a little curious here. Is it fun playing in a game with relatively no defense at all? Is it get a little, you know, just boring in a way, or is it kind of fun playing a free for all like that? Uh, both. I mean, it's fun to kind of get out there and do some dunks and stuff, stuff like that. But I mean, we're all competitors. I think it would be. I mean, I think everybody would enjoy it too that if we just play against each other and it gets competitive. And uh, obviously, the game wasn't closed at the end, really, so it didn't get to that point. But I mean, both both uh, style of places uh, they have their good stuff about them. So. Thank you. Thank you.